The World Health Organization is dedicated to achieving global health security and ensuring that every individual in the world has access to life-saving vaccines. The objectives of this campaign align quite well with the new targets of the WHO Southeast Asia region. And this target is to achieve measles and rubella elimination by 2026. This goal is a part of the strategic plan for measles and rubella elimination and sustenance in the WHO, Southeast Asia region 2024-2028 by targeting the 2030 age groups, Sri Lanka aims to close the immunity gaps and prevent future outbreaks, thereby moving closer to these targets. The other objective is to achieve the high immunization coverage. Achieving the high immunization coverage is crucial to reach and share herd immunity. This campaign is designed to reach those who may have been missed by the who may have missed their routine vaccinations, thereby protecting both individuals and also broader community. Through this campaign, The capacity of Sri Lanka's health system will also be strengthened. WHO provides financial and technical support and we support assist the country to become more resilient, to assist the country's health system to become more resilient, being fully capable of responding to future public health challenges. WHO is happy to contribute to this campaign through comprehensive technical assistance, including the development of the vaccination strategies, training and capacity building of healthcare workers, and also supporting the monitoring and evaluation systems. 
Additionally, WHO also provides some financial resources to support the logistics and also operational aspects of this campaign. In conclusion, WHO remains committed to supporting Sri Lanka in its efforts to protect the population from missiles and rubella. Through our collaborative efforts, we aim to achieve the high immunization coverage and safeguard the health of all age groups. Thank you very much. say that UNICEF is very proud to have been closely supporting the national immunization program in Sri Lanka since the beginning, together with WHO as well. And uh, the national immunization program of Sri Lanka, I have to say that is a success story. With over 95% coverage for every vaccine provided for children in the program. But uh, we have to make sure that we don't leave anybody behind. In 1974, when the expanded program of immunization was initiated, UNICEF fully supported this program, which was directly contributed to impressive reductions in child and infant mortality over many years. The more people who are vaccinated, the fewer people will be infected, and the less widely a disease can spread. Immunization really saves lives, and it has been a major reason for the drastic reduction in child mortality across the world over the last 25 years. We are all aware that immunization is a well attested practice in Sri Lanka, and the number of serodose children is minimal. This is not the case in many countries. Sri Lanka successfully controlled measles outbreaks and achieved measles elimination status in 2019. We are aware that a resurgence of measles cases has been observed since May 2023, primarily among young adults aged between 20 and 30 years. They are the primary reservoirs of infections, uh, driving transmission within communities. As a result, Young children and infants under nine months have also been affected. I am happy to recall that UNICEF supported the Ministry of Health to conduct a successful measles supplementary immunization campaign in January 2024. The current campaign, which will kick off on November 9th, targets youth between 20 and 30 years with a special focus on those who work or move in high risk populated, populated settings. To effectively reach this target group with critical information on the measles vaccine, UNICEF supported the development of engaging and relatable awareness materials together with the epidemiology unit and the health promotion bureau. We began by looking at existing insights on these demogra demographic specific concerns, preferences and trusted platforms which reveal that young adults value transparency, fact-based information, and practical relevance. Our materials have been designed to provide information about the disease and its repercussions if infected, because we are addressing a crowd that has never witnessed measles, nor has heard of it, apart from the vaccine given to them as infants. We also aim to address vaccine efficacy, safety, and immunization personal and communal benefits. We adopted a, a straightforward conversational tone, complemented by compelling visuals to communicate key messages to Recognizing the digital habits of this group, we are leveraging social media channels, using infographics and short videos, optimized mobile viewing. We are also planning to collaborate with some popular influencers to further amplify our reach. 
By centering on young adults' perspectives, we strive to successfully craft a campaign that empowers the youth to make informed decisions on measles vaccination. In addition, UNIVERSE will continue to support vaccine procurement through our organized supply system. I am also happy to mention that during the past few years, UNIVERSE has supported filling all identified gaps in equipment required to maintain the cold chain and the right qualified quality of vaccines provided in the national immunization campaign. This will undoubtedly enable the country to run this special business rubella immunization campaign smoothly. Currently, UNICEF is also supporting training the technical staff of cold chain equipment, maintenance to ensure the effective utilization of equipment that will ensure the safety of vaccines. Lastly, we hope all 20, 30 year olds in the selected districts and in selected institutions will participate actively in the special measles rubella immunization campaign and I wish the Ministry of Health and Epidemiology Unit a successful and effective special measles rubella campaign ahead. Thank you. Vishesh's Saram for Saharubilla, but the Shakti Kuran events and Hana Pilibandava, our country do. Vishesh a Purti Saka Chava, our Sani Bagita then in the BCD. Other me Purti Saka Chava, Sarta Kuragan in the Kayuni, who Sampa Dai Kingi, Levin Sahayoginata, the other Sampa Dai Kandesa, Upper High Group, South Kamata, and she knew Jack Dakshu within a ride, Martin South Kaker, is him Anil Mahadadi, a member. So, we have to do the same thing with 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 the same the the and, and also the representative from the UNICEF, uh, Mrs. Miss Bekona, and the uh, and uh, and the other uh, representative from the UNICEF and the UNFP. Eva Gema, other Apaha Eku, Pasantaroga, Anche, Sieruba, Mrs. Sanja Baidur, Saha Baidurunta, Kavada, Apaha Ekwana, Madhuri Dinu, over Sieru Dinata. Remember, 